Welcome to the Inorganic Chemistry Lab at WJE's Janney Technical Center. My name is Carl Jasinecki and I am a chemistry technician here at the JTC. We perform a wide variety of tests on various materials in the lab, but by far the most common tests we perform are the chloride tests on concrete and various cementitious materials. What are chlorides? A chloride is a negatively charged chlorine ion. We generally are looking for salts such as sodium chloride and calcium chloride. The sample we'll be testing today is from a reinforced concrete bridge in the Chicago area. This bridge is subjected to chlorides from de-icing salts. The freeze-thaw cycle from Chicago winters also damages the concrete pore structure and allows chlorides to migrate down to the reinforcing steel. This both weakens the steel structure and causes expansion products to build up which can damage the concrete as well. The first step is obtaining a sample. The cores are marked for depth. Then these depths are cut into smaller slices, like this one here. These slices are then ground to a specific fineness, such as this, and placed in a polycon, which is then labeled so we know which sample goes to which core at which depth. Step two, we weigh these powdered samples on a highly precise digital balance. After weighing, the samples are taken over to the fume hood here. We add nitric acid, bring the samples to a boil, and then it's on to step four where we filter the samples and concentrate the chlorides. Step five is the titration step where we will determine the chloride content of the sample. The results of this test indicate elevated levels of chloride in the cementitious sample. This is likely to induce corrosion on the steel reinforcement of the concrete bridge. This data will be relayed to our engineers at WJE who will use it in their service life modeling. This will allow our clients to decide whether to proceed with repair or remediation of the structure based on our test results. Thanks for stopping by the Janney Technical Center.